What's poppin' family? It's your girl Tara Chantel. I hope you guys are having a marvelous day. And we got Chipotle! Chipotle is live. So y'all, I waited an hour for this. An hour. Okay. A whole hour. Thank you, Lord, for this meal. May it nourish and make me flourish. Whew. They got this packed in. Packed. I gotta open it correctly because you guys can't be tripping. Oh. So I got queso. That was the first thing. Queso pico. Corn, tomato, chicken, fajitas, and sour cream. Tell me why. They was out of hot sauce. They was out of hot sauce. So how do y'all eat y'all chipotle? Do you shake it up? Because I got to have it. Shook, shook. Shake. Ooh. Ooh. Yes. Yes. Get it. Get it. How you live. Mm. Mm. So we got that's gonna be our hot sauce. You, know I mean? you know, we eat like in steps. You gotta eat it like in steps with it. You can't just whole hour, y'all. It's busting. I'm gonna cap. It's busting. Eat with the lid. Um, this time I got my eyes open. <laughs> A fun fact. I used to work at a Chipotle. Literally the best job ever. Even though it was like real demanding. It was the littest job. Ever. It was so lit. 
I met so many great people. But now I barely eat it because I used to eat it for a year straight, like a year straight. So I know the ins and outs, honey, about Chipotle. So I know why y'all addicted because I know what they add in it. <laughs> I'm just playing. But it be buzzing. It be buzzing. It be buzzing. It be buzzing. Look at that. Look. So I eat mine in like a step. Like, I be having to mix it up. You gotta shake it up and stuff. I don't know how people just don't like they food being shook up like how oh, weird but yeah i was so upset they didn't have hot sauce so y'all remember that story sour cream extra because i'm extra i like the it i don't know why they gave me a extra large but i'm like hey cool cool do you boo do you i ain't even about to complain with it do freaking you so don't y'all remember the story i wanted to tell you on the last muck bomb so i drive left and do you be having crazy people? I be like, no, because I'm not crazy. <laughs> you are who you attract. Um, so, I met this gentleman. I picked him up from the hospital. His spirit was still so vibrant and upbeat when I met him when he got in my car and then I started talking to him like he started talking to me cuz you know how people just don't be want to talk in car rides and I be like cool cuz I don't want to talk either cuz you see I be talking to y'all all day so I always wait for people to initiate a conversation with me And he did. And what he told me said that he has incurable cancer in the throat. And he only has two years to live. When I told you, I didn't know how to respond to that. I'm like, you're trying to, you're trying to make me cry. I'm like, you really, I'm trying to, I'm over here trying to drive and concentrate, and I can't, because I just heard the sad news. But that, that ride plays such a huge role in my spirit. It plays such a huge role in my spirit. And you got to live every day like it's your last. And I was just telling him, nobody knows the truth. Nobody has that power but God. So these doctors trying to have you anticipate your life. So you have a time clock like, oh, it's been two years. Time to go. Like, they don't know. But it just showed me that we have to live each day like it's our last. Because nothing is guaranteed. Tomorrow is not guaranteed. Love your loved one while you got them. 
Love on your people. Love on your people, man. Life is so short. Life is so precious. It's just, it's, 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 it's wild out here, man. Chop how to play. Oh my God, I'm about to. I could eat some more. I'm over there looking like, yo, that was so fly. That was so fly. That was so good. I might get some money. I only got like a half a left. Like, I, I ate half. I guess because. I ain't eat all day. Like, I just want a corner. Because, you know, you got to, like, for me, I think it's important to, uh, to preserve your food <laughs> when you don't got it like that. Like, all right, I'm getting food though. All right, start it up, start it up, start it up. I haven't had Chipotle. Since October, since the Halloween thing. And I was like, bro, I want Chipotle. I'm getting Chipotle. I don't want to cook today. Y'all see I be cooking. Y'all see it. I was like, I don't want to cook today. Okay? And I can honestly say, this was, I'm going to give it. 8.5 out of 10 and the reason why is the 8.5 because they didn't have hot sauce and I had to wait an hour but it was it, it was worth it I it taught me some patience that I need to you know develop but we get we get in there we get in there but y'all, I'm like an hour. I'm like they didn't give a crap. Cause I used to work at Chipotle. We used to be, psh, 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 psh. we used to be zooming through the stuff. But I'm like y'all taking y'all time, letting these online orders just add up. And I'm like yo, I calculated in my head. I'm like it's gonna be an hour. Is it worth it? Am I hungry? Is it worth it? I I was really contemplating. Cause I treat my time like Beyonce. I'm like, will Beyonce stay in line? <laughs> no, she will call somebody and tell her, pick it pick up my Chipotle. Pick up my Chipotle. <laughs> but mean, that's what you gotta treat your time, man. It's valuable out here. Last bite, and I'm saving the rest. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm full. I'm full. 
this hit. This was a go. It was a great investment. Cause you know, I be like, ooh, I could cook instead, save my money. But no, it was worth it. Sunday fun day. Hope you guys had a great day. I love you. Chipotle in life. Chipotle is bae. Chipotle is bae. <laughs> Y'all enjoy but the liquor. Mm, I love guac. Enjoy your day. I love you. Come back and eat with me next time. <laughs>